All right, we're in a, another crawl space. We can, uh, this is about insulation. Um, you can see we got the blue board up on the wall, which is great. They got it glued up. Good stuff. Um, and then at the sills here, you can see we have the, uh, the fiberglass bats. Um, I'm not a big fan of the fiberglass bats. Um, a lot of people aren't. Um, see it a lot because it's easier to put in. Obviously, because it's flexible, just cut it with a knife and put it in. But the, uh, the problem is with uh, air transfer. You got this, uh, you got your foundation down here and you got your sill up there, or that rim joist board, which is only, uh, you know, an inch and a half thick. And uh, you get a lot of air from the outside and then inside here in the air, in the uh, crawl space with uh, a lot of air transfer. And what happens with these fiberglass bats, they, uh, they're hard to get them s sealed up right um, just because of their flexible and, uh, and that's, that's, they're hard to do it that way. And then you get a lot of air transfer. And here's a case here where you can kind of see when we pull this away. Let's get this out of here. Kind of see first we got the insulation sticking, which is telling me that it, it was uh, it was wet. Um, I can actually even feel the dampness a little bit. And you can see it's kind of getting some black, black staining there. Um, that's generally what happens because you get that air. Like I said, that, that's the most vulnerable area for air transfer is this, this, this rim joist here. And uh, you don't get it sealed up right, and that's what happens. You get moisture that condenses back here, and then it, it can cause a host of problems. Now, this house is uh, fairly new, um, 10 to 15 years old. Um, give this about another 10 years, and we're going to start getting rot and everything else. Who knows? Insects, and uh, just not a good idea. Uh, I like to see um, you can put the blue board up here um, and cut that out, glue it, and then spray foam around the edges. That's, uh, that's a good way of doing it, or you can just spray foam the whole thing. Um, blue board's a little bit, I like that better because you can take it out if ever need be. Uh, you don't have this, the uh, spray foam to worry about, but either way is uh, better than the, uh, the old fiberglass bats here. Um, all right, that's it. It's Josh Frederick, ASPEC Residential Services, Northwest Ohio Home Inspections. Thanks.